I'm so happy to present a special Tony Award for lifetime achievement in the theatre to a living legend. Just recently, 54 years after she won a Best Actress Tony Award, I had the pleasure of working with her in Lincoln Center Theatre's award-winning production of Lerner and Lowe's My Fair Lady. She's still starring in the role she began just one week before her 91st birthday. It's an honor for me to present the special Tony Award for Lifetime Achievement in the Theatre to Ms. Rosemary Harris. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, I first won my first Tony Award and it came in a little white box which uh, I've kept in, on a bookcase all these years and I've never had one to hold in my hand like this so I'm very, very grateful. Um, because I'm very old, I have a... Oh, first of all, I must thank the Broadway League and the American Theatre Wing, of course, for giving me this. But because I'm very, very old, I have an awful lot of people to thank, but I'm going to make it very short. I'm going to start at the beginning and then skip to the end. In 1952, the great Moss Hart came to England and he invited me to come from England to America to be in his play, The Climate of Eden, for which I am endlessly grateful. Now, I'm going to skip 65 years. <laughs> You'll all be happy for that. And I am going to thank the great Andre Bishop who, thank, who brought me from North Carolina, invited me from North Carolina to, to New York to be in this extraordinary, wonderful production at Lincoln Center of My Fair Lady, where I am so happily there now. Um, <laughs> wonderful, wonderful production. Thank you, Bart, and everybody else who was involved in it. It was like getting on an express train that was moving, but I'm so happy to be on it. And now I want to thank my beloved husband of 50 years, who for 50 years put up with a wife who worked nights. And my, our wonderful daughter, our double Tony winner, Jennifer Ely, who... <laughs> when she was a little girl, had to put up with a mother who took a lot of naps. <laughs> and finally, I want to thank my beloved friend and agent, Johnny Planko, who has passed away very, very recently, but he helped me so much in my career, and I want to thank him especially for this. And finally, I think we should all thank all the theatre-goers, past, present, and future, who make all this possible. Thank you so much.